is it that important where you're going that you would risk injuring or killing a student? Thanks for joining us. An upstate school bus driver is being called a hero. This is the video here showing you the car speeding past a school bus while students are trying to cross that street. Now tonight we are hearing from that bus driver. The school district says her actions help to avoid a tragedy here. 7 News reporter Nikkel Smith is joining us right now with more on this story. Nikkel. Well, Tom and Amy, district leaders say this is part of an ongoing issue where drivers seem to ignore buses stopped for students. Maryland Masters has been taking kids to school. I'm going to watch my students. For over two decades. I just love it and I love the students. When transporting those children, she says their safety is her main priority. Our students are precious cargo. She says the relationship with her students helped protect them when a car careened past the stopped school bus. I stopped and I'm holding my students. Holding her hand out warned the three students to stay in one spot, but video shows one car kept going when Masters activated the stop arm. The third student was just walking up and I started to look back up to make sure the traffic had stopped. I saw the front was stopped and there was this gold flash that came around the side of the bus and it was moving. It happened on Highway 418 right at the Jenkins Bridge Road intersection around 740 as Masters was taking students to Woodmont High School. It kind of came around the front like this. I didn't know was it going to go that way to them. The students are okay, but Masters says she's no stranger to stop arm violators. For me, it could be anywhere from seven to ten times a month. District leaders say it's a serious issue. Our hearts sank because we, we were seconds away from tragedy this morning. Thanks to our, our bus driver, she was a true hero. Master says she was just doing her job and taking care of her students. I hope it doesn't have to be a worse situation before people take notice. District leaders say they were not able to see the tag from that video, but Highway Patrol is investigating. District leaders also say they're always looking for more drivers like Masters as the district continues dealing with a bus driver shortage. You can find information on how to apply on WSPA.com. Amy. Nikkel, thank you. About two years ago, a bill passed allowing districts to have stop arm cameras to help catch the violators. This year, legislators are discussing a bill about mailing citations to the registered owner of the vehicle without identifying the driver via video.